subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest tech videos hey what's up youtube this is wasi here and today in this video i'm going to show you how you can change the boot sequence on your asus laptop or pc so that you can boot up a usb drive on it and install windows or any other operating system on your laptop or pc so the bios in asus is quite different and difficult as compared to dell or hp but in this video i'm going to show you everything step by step so that you can accomplish your goal so let's start the video tutorial so here before i even insert the bootable usb to the laptop first of all we need to change or confirm some settings on the bios of your asus laptop first of all you are going to power on your laptop and you are going to press on the f2 key continuously in order to open the bios setup as you can see on the screen right now so after you are in the bios you need to change some of the settings first first of all you need to go to the security section as you can see on the top side so in order to go there you are going to press on the right key so here as you can see on the keyboard the right key is just beside your numpad so here when we are in the security section we need to go on to the last option where it says secure, secure boot menu we are going to go to the very last option we are going to press select secure boot menu and here you can see it says secure boot disabled so you need to make sure that secure boot is disabled in your case uh, if you don't disable it then your laptop or your asus laptop will not read the bootable windows pen drive or usb stick so you need to make sure that the secure boot option is disabled in my case it is already disabled again if you want to go back we are going to press on the escape key so now we are going to go on to the boot options again you are going to press on the left key on your keyboard here you can say it says launch csm here it is launch csm and it is disabled so you need to enable this option as well we are going to go to launch csm we are going to press on enter to select it and we are going to enable this option so once you have done these two settings on the bias as i have told you then you are just simply going to plug in your usb drive So once uh, added, we are going to go on to save and exit using the right key. We are going to press on save changes and exit. Enter. Yes. And now when the laptop will boot up, it should automatically detect the USB hard drive. But if it is still not detecting, then there is another thing you can do. So again, I am going to power off my PC. I am going to power on again. And I am going to press on the escape key continuously. And you will have this pop-up menu showed up. So here it will show you your USB name. Uh, if you have an ASUS USB, it will show anything Dell, HP, etc. Or an Sandix one. But if it is still not showing, then you need to select this option where it says Vendor Co Product Code. I am going to go here on this option because the uh, Slim Type DVD A is your DVD base code, and this one is your hard drive code P1 and P0. So the third thing, whichever you have, will be obviously your USB drive. As long as you have done the steps as I showed you on the BIOS previously. So here on this option, I'm going to press on enter. And here you can see it has detected my uh, bootable Windows drive. So I can just press on Windows installer. And I'm just going to install Windows 10 on this particular laptop. So guys, if you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. If you have any kind of questions regarding this video, write them in the comment section below. I will try to answer all the questions as well. And guys, I have already made a video. If you're going to get a ASUS BIOS shown on your laptop or PC repeatedly, how you can resolve that problem. Uh, the video will be shown right here. A box should appear right here. And I will also put that video's link in this video description as well. So if you can, if you want to check it out, you can go and do so. And that's all for this video. Thank you for watching this video and stay safe.